Hey fellow dadpreneurs, Adam Dix here, and in this video I'm going to share with you how I generated $4,300 in the last 30 days leveraging TikTok. It's not just a platform for single moms and teenagers to twerk to the new Drake song. It's a platform um, that you can make money from. You can generate a ton of attention and interest, leads, and then sales. It's just a, it's a funnel. That's all it is. There are people on there that are willing to spend money. There are older people on there. I've spoke with a few on the phone in their 50s. You know, I thought it was all teenagers just a few short months ago, but I was dead wrong. There are some grown up adults there looking for solutions to their problems. So in this video, I'm going to walk you through my seven part framework on how you can set up and do the exact same thing leveraging TikTok. Now a few people, this was a YouTube live stream that I did yesterday. I had a couple technical difficulties, so I am re-recording this now, but a few people reached out to me asking what if the US bans TikTok or shuts it down or whatever, because that, that's kind of the chatter uh, in the US right now. And there's nothing I can do about it. I don't have any control over that. I, you probably don't either. Um, so I can't, I'm not going to worry about it. I don't worry about what I can't control. So I'm not worried about it. If it happens, it happens. However, this seven part framework, the seventh part is the TikTok part. The six other parts um, have nothing to do with it. If TikTok bans tomorrow, you can use the same framework on Twitter or Facebook or YouTube or Snapchat or LinkedIn or Pinterest or Instagram. It really doesn't matter. The only variable is that seventh step, the TikTok. So if TikTok is banned tomorrow, just swap it out for Twitter or YouTube or whatever other channel. So you need to have these first six steps in place no matter what channel you're leveraging. So that's my take on it. Also, I am always trying to build my email list on whatever platform I'm on. That's something you own. That's something you control for something like if TikTok were to shut down tomorrow, I've got about 1,500 leads that I've generated in the last three months, their email addresses that I own, that I control, that I can mar continue marketing to. Uh, I recommend that on these videos all the time, build your email list, build your email list, build your email list, because you're not in control of what TikTok does. Or maybe YouTube shuts you down. I've heard horror stories. Or Facebook bans you. I've heard horror stories. You always want to be uh, collecting email addresses, build your email list, because that's something you own, you control, and you can leverage for years and years and years and years to come. So always build the email list. If TikTok shuts down tomorrow, uh, who cares? I'll move to a different platform. That's my thinking of it. For right now, I'm doubling down on TikTok because it's working so well, I want to capitalize on this opportunity. I advise you to do the same uh, while it's here, while we still can. Um, if it doesn't get banned, it's going, the organic reach, the free traffic is going to dwindle down like it ha does on every other social media channel. Eventually, they're going to introduce ads, which actually is days away um, their ad platform. Once that comes, the organic traffic is going to start slowing down. Um, so like I said, take advantage of it while you can. Let me switch over my screen here. So seven steps to start earning money on TikTok. This works in any niche, any industry. It does not matter if you need to send traffic to your website, your blog, your podcast, your YouTube channel, your Instagram account, your Amazon listing, your Shopify store. It doesn't matter. This works for anything. So here's your step-by-step -step action plan. So this is uh, one program, one company that I promote. I'm an affiliate for. Uh, as you can see, every day is not a winner. Uh, it's, it's, and, and I'm not gonna bullshit you. Dollar forty, a thousand dollars, twenty-one seventy-five. 4,300 of the last 30 days, which is an average of about $143 a day. So on average, it works out pretty nicely. Um, but again, not every day is a winner, not every day is uh, $1,000. So affiliate marketing, a lot of people confuse affiliate marketing and MLM. There's some similarities. I'm not gonna, uh, I'm not gonna lie there. Uh, however, they're different. Affiliate marketing is I'm recommending a product or service or piece of software and I earn a percentage of the sale. That's it. There's no tiers. There's no, I don't earn money if that customer buys something and, or, or that customer recommends another customer and like a pyramid, you know, like MLM. That's not what it is. It's just, I'm recommending a product. Amazon has a affiliate program, Nike, Home Depot, Walmart, eBay, just about every company online has an affiliate program. Why affiliate marketing? You don't have to create a product or service yourself. Uh, the only thing you have to do is send traffic to the company's webpage. That is it. That's the only your only objective, send traffic. So it eliminates the confusion, overwhelm, and complexity of an online business uh, because you only have to focus on one thing, driving traffic. That's it. You don't have to do anything else. Which takes me to my next point. You don't have to worry about customer service. You don't have customers. You're referring them. So you don't have to worry about customer service. You can pick and promote from thousands of products online. I'm going to show you a couple websites on how to find products in any niche, any market. 
You can literally make as much as you want or as little as you want. This is something you could earn a couple hundred dollars on the side a month, um, a couple thousand a month, um, or turn it into a full-fledged business. Business. It's completely up to you. There's not a right or wrong way. Uh, it's just up to you. Typically, you start earning a couple hundred. You see that you can do it. You get excited. You build momentum. You gain confidence. Then you start going into the thousands. And then next thing you know, you're telling your boss to piss off. I'm doing my own thing now. So it's up to you. Like I said, there's not a right or wrong. You can get started for very little investment. It doesn't take a lot of time. Once you have this system that I'm going to explain here set up, it does all the heavy lifting for you. Or I should, yes, it does 95% of the heavy lifting for you. Your only thing that you have to do on a daily basis is put out TikToks for this specific example. If it was Twitter or YouTube or whatever, putting out content is a non-negotiable. You have to do that. You just have to pick which platform. This video obviously is about TikTok. So, um, and very little money investment. I'm gonna recommend one tool. That's the only tool you need. Contrary to popular belief, you don't need 17 tools. You need one. When you start earning consistent money, then you can upgrade your tools, you can get more tools. But for right now, you only need one tool and I'm gonna show you which one it is in just a second. So step number one, you wanna find your pocket of people. This is your audience, this is your niche market, a group of people that are facing, uh, that are uh, have an obstacle, a problem, a challenge that they're trying to overcome. So here's a few examples. What obstacles have you overcame in your life? Maybe you've went through divorce. Maybe you've lost weight. Maybe you've put on muscle. Maybe you've gained confidence. Whatever it is, this is what you can be putting TikToks about. Your journey of going through it. What you did that worked. What you did do that didn't work. What you would avoid. What you'd do different. All kinds of things. It's exactly what I'm doing with this YouTube channel. Model me. What problems have you solved? Maybe you reduced diabetes. You started, you made a carrot and asparagus and whipped cream <laughs> smoothie and it helped uh, reduce diabetes. You know, well, whipped cream probably wouldn't, but um, or cured acne. Maybe you adjusted your diet, exercised more, went to bed, uh, slept longer, drank more water, cured acne. Uh, maybe you taught your kids how to eat vegetables. As a parent, that is something I would like to learn how to do. Um, I'm just giving you these random examples to show you there is, these are all problems that people are facing. Not all people, um, but there are people that struggle with diabetes and maybe you struggled with it before and you did something that helped you get through it or cured acne or taught your kids how to eat vegetables. These are all real world problems that people face. It's not just about making money online. A lot of people teach how to make money online, but there's it. you can make money in any, any, any group of people that's having a problem, they're looking for a solution. And typically that solution is going to cost money. So I'm trying to expand your mind basically. So maybe you mastered a skill. Maybe you mastered web design. Maybe you, I'm a very good writer. Maybe you mastered video editing. I self-taught myself web design at YouTube University for zero dollars and zero cents. I'm not a video editing master. Steven Spielberg ain't gonna be calling me next week to do ET2. Um, however, I've learned a video editing on YouTube University for zero dollars and zero cents. And I've gotten a lot better with it because I've practiced it a lot. So maybe you have a skill. I, I could teach people video editing, the very basics of video editing, because what I've done just myself uh, over the last year, putting out these YouTube videos. So you might have a specific skill that you've learned. Maybe it's a job that you're currently working in or you used to work in. Maybe you've been in a career for 20 years and there's, there's plenty of skills that you have. A lot of people overlook this. They think, oh, I'm not an expert or oh, I don't have any skills. Bullshit. You certainly do. You have experiences. You have, a sk you have skills. Those are valuable to people. You have to remember, talk to the person who is just starting on that journey whether it's losing weight, whether it's starting a job in HR, whatever it is, talk to the person yourself. What advice would you give yourself before you face that challenge, that obstacle, or started learning that skill? Maybe you have a hobby. You can earn money off of hobbies, hunting, fishing, camping, riding bikes, um, running, walking, <laughs> horseback riding, whatever it is, hobbies. You can put out content around those and recommend products, like websites that have hunting, uh, hunting websites, fishing, camping, recommend products. There are also digital trainings. I recommend um, being an affiliate for a digital training because the margins are much, much higher. This ink pen right here, you could sell this on Amazon and be an affiliate for it. You're probably gonna earn five cents. <laughs> so not a lot of money because the margins are so small. 
but it is possible to do a, um, physical products. I like digital products, but I just want to let you know you can be an affiliate for physical products. Amazon, Nike, Bose, Home Depot, Walmart, eBay, they all have affiliate programs. You can become an affiliate and market any products that those stores carry and earn money from it. Again, since it's a physical product, you're going to earn a very, very small percentage as opposed to a digital product. Step number two is setting up your profile for success. This translates to any social media platform. This example is just TikTok, but it, it, uh, this framework works for any social media profile. So this is a good framework to use. I help X achieve Y so that they can Z. So X is your pocket of people, your niche, your target market. Y is what you do, what you teach. And then Z is the ultimate outcome. And I don't know how to spell ultimate, apparently. So let me give you a couple examples. I help dads, dads being the X, the target market, earn money online, Y, what I do, what I teach, so that they can spend more time with their family. Z, the ultimate outcome. Another example is I help divorced dads, divorced dads being the target market, increase their confidence, what I do, what I teach, so that they can date whoever they please. Z, the ultimate outcome. One more is I help millennials, millennials being the X, the target market, build a YouTube channel. Why? That's what I do or what I teach so that they can effortlessly sell their courses. Z, that is the ultimate outcome. Now, there are millennials that want to build a YouTube channel not for this benefit, sell their courses. Maybe they don't have a course. Maybe they just want to boost their status. Maybe they want to just build a business or generate attention and awareness or get brand deals. There's a lot of different outcomes for different millennials building a YouTube channel. This cuts through the noise that you only service millennials looking to build a YouTube channel who want to sell their course. It's very, very, very specific. These people have different problems than others. That's why it's very important to get very dialed in on your target market. Set up your lead capture page. So your lead capture is basically the front door to your online business. This attracts leads, prospects, and builds your email list. Uh, projects is the wrong word. Your email list and the relationship you build with it is the most valuable cash producing asset that you own. You own it, you control it, you can market to them today, tomorrow, next week, next month, next year. Very, very powerful. You want to build your email list each and every day. You'll discover that you can make money on command by sending out emails to your database. Now that you have this built-in audience that already raised their hand, giving you their name and their email address for help on losing acne or reducing diabetes or whatever it is, you can sell them other products around that in the future over and over and over your own products you could create your own products and sell them to them over and over and over you just have a group an audience a very targeted audience that already gave you permission to email them so the tool i recommend to set up a landing page a lead capture page is bird send we're going to get into how to set up bird send in just a second so we want to find a product to promote so finding solutions, there's a few ways you can do this. A popular website is called ClickBank. This is a digital marketplace of thousands of products in just about every niche imaginable. So arts and entertainment as seen on TV, betting system, business, computers, education, employment, fiction, games, green products. And then you just click on these and it just opens up even more subcategories. So for this example, I'm gonna do parenting since I'm a dad, we're gonna to go to parenting here and then they are going to list out all the products under parenting so here is the one product that we're going to uh, set up a demo one for so average sale uh, if they purchase through my affiliate link i'll earn on average 18 dollars 74 so if you click the link here this will open up the sales page to the product so here it is here's a video that plays let's go back here real quick and then this affiliate page right here not all of these products have it uh, but a lot of them do and basically what this is is marketing material or sales collateral that they're giving to us on a silver platter saying help us make more sales basically uh, this one's a great example not all of them are this detailed but as you can see they give a ton infographics if you wanted to include those on your website you could articles blog posts you could copy and paste those add them into your blog banners down the side of your website you could have these banners um, a lot they're giving you a lot of marketing material. So what we're going to do, not quite yet, we are going to use the emails here. And we're going to set that up in just a second. I just wanted to, so here's the emails. Let me just go back to the presentation. Another website is Google. Uh, we've all heard of that one. And basically, I'm just going to do a quick example. So let's say parenting training plus affiliate program. 
something along those lines. You can tweak the tweak the wording. Let's see. You can do parenting, whatever niche you're in, confidence, lose weight, keto, diabetes, acne, removal, uh, whatever niche you're in, and then plus affiliate programs or affiliate program or join our affiliate program. You just kind of got to play around with the wording a little bit, and then you can just go down and search through um, these parenting courses or programs that have affiliates. So some of these are going to be, this is a blog post someone wrote, top 10 parenting affiliate programs. So they've kind of done some of the research for you, which is really helpful. And this is the case for a lot of the bigger niches. So you just kind of go through and you can find products this way as well. So you don't have to use ClickBank. Uh, obviously ClickBank makes it easier as they have it all right here on one website. With that being said, it's much, much, much more competitive. So doing it this way, the Google way, you're going to, you can find some hidden gems that aren't nearly as competitive of as the ones on Clickbank so there's not a right or wrong way to do it I just wanted to show you that there's two ways to do it so step number five you want to decide on a domain name and I like having catchy two word two to three word domain names that you can kind of rattle off the top of your head easy to say I have a full in-depth video that you can check out up here um, but they're easy to say they're easy to spell so name mesh it's a free website and basically what you do let's say parenting you can type in your keyword or keywords. You can do two or three words. You don't have to do one. And then what you're going to do is generate. It opens up another website, but we're going to close that out. And then this is going to give you domains that are available uh, with the word parenting in it. Again, you can use two or three words if you wanted. So these are uh, kind of ones with uh, newer extensions. I don't really look at here. I typically would go down to the SEO section. So I'm going to go through and look for one, 99parenting.com, hitparenting.com, bitparenting, hotparenting, beta parenting, biparenting. You just kind of scroll through and find a good domain name that's available. Uh, let me see if I can, not, not many good ones uh, for this one. Um, Let's just say host parenting. I have no idea what that is. We'll just say host parenting. Um, that one is, or parentingville. That's a better one. Parentingville.com. We're going to purchase that. We're going to go use Namecheap. You can pick that up. Let me see. Parentingville. We'll go to Namecheap. I just started using these as, started purchasing my domain names with, so parentingville.com. We'll hit search and then it's going to show that it's available as long as I spelled it right. It is, so you can purchase it for $8.88 for the year. So you'll get Parentingville and then you're going to forward that to what we're going to cover in the next step. So you're going to put Parentingville in your TikTok profile, your Facebook profile, your Twitter profile, your YouTube, wherever the hell you're active on social media. You're going to put that everywhere. You can put it in your email signature. Again, it's easy to remember. It's easy to spell. This one might be a little tricky with the E on the end, but you get the point. You want some, a, a simple domain name that you can just reference anytime and then it's going to forward to what we're about to cover. So step number six is you need to write out your email sequence. So we're going to use BirdSend for this. So let me go back. So we kind of, I had to show you the steps and then we're going to not necessarily work backwards, but I kind of wanted to show you a couple of the steps. So now we're going to get BirdSend. We're going to set up our emails, set up our lead capture page all within BirdSend and tie everything, the last couple minutes all together. So what we need to do first is click email. We're going to click automations and we need to create a sequence. Over in the right hand corner, we're going to say new sequence. And this thing is called Baby Sleep Miracle is what we're promoting for the example. And I'm going to go over here to the affiliate right here. So email marketing, they're giving us the emails. So I'm going to copy the subject line. This is the subject line they recommend. I'm going to go back over to BirdSend. So here's how you set up your emails in BirdSend. It's a simple, simple platform. So this email will be sent immediately once someone enters their name and email. We'll copy here. That's the subject line. What's really cool about BirdSend is you can resend to people who didn't open the email. So you can do it one day, two day, three day, 10 days later. It's optional. You don't have to do that. Uh, I typically do one day later and you can change the subject line if you want. For this example, we're just going to keep it. Go back and then what we're going to do is copy email one, 
Go back here, paste. That's it. And what you're going to want to do is, so it says discover how to do it right here in this video. You're going to want to highlight this and you're going to grab your affiliate link. So when you sign up for ClickBank, you're going to get an option. You're going to be able to, you have to sign up for an account. It's completely free, but you need to get your affiliate link. So my affiliate username is just Adam Duke. So create my affiliate link. So here's my affiliate link here. So I would highlight that. What I like to do is open up a notepad and just paste it there. Go back to BirdSend, highlight this, click the link here, insert link, copy, paste, insert. Now it's a live link. I like to highlight it and underline it and bold it as well. Whoops. It says it's bold, but it doesn't look bold to me. I'll underline it. So there we go. And then you'd sign off. I'll put Adam. We'll hit update. And now email number one is ready. It's going to be sent out immediately when they submit their name and email. We'll set up one more email. I want to show you how simple this is. New email, click here. We'll click on here. We'll highlight email number two. We're going to go back over to this affiliate page. Click on email marketing. And we're going to go to email two. We're going to copy this one. Paste. We'll just use the same subject line, but you can change it if you want. Go back over and highlight this. Paste. I put some spaces in here as that looks a little kind of a little weird. There we go. And I'm going to grab my affiliate link on my notepad, copy. Right there, insert link here. I typically do open in a new tab. I think I forgot on the initial email. Hit insert. Let's underline that so they can really see it. And then I put my email, or my name, I'm sorry. Click update, bam, two emails done. These emails are gonna be sent out to you automatically. Uh, they're gonna work for you 24 seven, 365. And then you just repeat the process. Click new email, go here. This is email number three, email number four. They have quite a few, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So they have nine emails. So you just repeat the process here. And then all the emails would be here. If you need to move them around, you can highlight them, move it like that, move it down. It's really, really slick. You'll be able to see your stats right here, how many were sent, percentage of open, percentage of clicked, really, really helpful. And then what we're gonna do is turn this on right here. So we'll flip it on. So now this email automation is ready. So the emails are done and written out. Now what we need to do is create our lead capture. Whoops, I forgot to hit update because I made some changes. We'll go to forms and we'll create new form. Baby Sleep Miracle. Hit create. And now this is going to be our landing page. So here it is right here. We're going to just, you can connect to WordPress if you have a WordPress website. If not, you don't need it. We'll click welcome screen. We'll do this one. We're going to turn off the bird send branding. And basically what I like to do is go back to the sales page. And I like to use this headline right here on the landing page. So child psychologist weird trick gets any baby to sleep. Weird trick gets any baby to sleep. Of course, I spelled that one wrong. Let's space it out properly. We'll go back. Um, there's no subheadline. We'll go back to bird send. We'll just delete this. We'll delete this. Just, there we go. And capitalize baby. Uh, we can change the background. You could put a picture you, so you can Go here and update. You can change it to a solid color or you can click on it again and upload an image to use or uh, a URL. Maybe a mother with a sleeping baby or maybe a baby crying might be better. Um, for this example, I'm just gonna go with a solid black background. I like the look of that. You can edit this if you wanted to. Um, if you wanted to add their name, I like getting their name as well. So click field, click plus. 
Now we're going to collect their first name and their email address. So that is all set up. Post submit means what happens after they submit their name and their email. Where do you want to send them? So what we're going to do is we're going to send them to the affiliate link. So after they submit their name and their email, they're going to be redirected to this page right here with our affiliate link. This is how we're going to earn money. Double opt-in, I turn off. Post submission, we need to connect the landing page with the email sequence that we just created. So what we're going to do is new action, and we're going to subscribe to sequence, the baby, what's it called, baby sleep. Whoops. Baby Sleep Miracle, that's the sequence we just created with those two emails. Integration, you can integrate it with uh, your website if you have a WordPress website. You don't need one. We're going to go over here, Bird Send Hosted Page. And here is our URL. Let's hit update real quick. Now when I click this link, this is going to be our landing page. Ta-da! Let's test it out. Adam at TotalDads.com. Now when I hit instant access, I should be redirected to the sales page, which will be my affiliate link. Boom, there we go, just like that. So this URL is kind of long, as you can see, app.birdsend.co slash forms 5672 hosted, kind of a mouthful to say. That's why we're gonna do this domain, the Parentingville. We're gonna purchase that at Namecheap Purchase this for $8.88. And then what you're going to want to do is set up a redirect. It's very simple. They have um, tutorials on how to set it up in Namecheap. It's very, very common. So now when people click Parentingville in our TikTok profile, Facebook, Snapchat, LinkedIn, wherever the hell you share this URL, it's going to redirect them to this page right here. And then when they put their name and their email, click get instant access, it's going to send them to the sales page with your affiliate link. So if they purchase, if we go back over here, on average, you're gonna earn $18.74 a sale. So that's how you set it all up. Let's go back to the presentation. So we wrote out the email sequence. Like I said, we only did two emails. I would, I would leverage all the emails that they give you. I think it was nine. Step number seven, make TikToks. That's it, that's literally it. Everything else is set up. Your system is running for you 24-7, 365. All you need to focus on is sending traffic to that URL, parentingville.com, and that's all the, all the work you need to do. Like I said, if you don't want to make TikToks, you can do Twitter or YouTube or Facebook or Instagram. It really does. This set, part seven is interchangeable. You can swap it out for anything. If TikTok shuts down tomorrow, plug in Twitter, plug in YouTube, plug in whatever the hell you want. But that is literally it to start earning money on TikTok or any social media platform. It's exactly what I'm doing with this YouTube channel. All those links down there, they follow this exact process. My link on Facebook and Twitter, all that, they follow this exact same process. It works. It doesn't take long to set up. Watch this video, pause it, rewind it, fast forward. Do whatever the hell you have to do, but get it set up. Like I said, once steps one through six are set up, you don't have to do anything else. All you have to do is focus on step number seven, which is making TikToks or putting out content, let's say. So that's literally it. It's really not that difficult. I don't want to say it's easy, uh, but it's simple. It's very simple. This is how you have a, a leads and sales machine working for you 24-7, 365. It's constantly working for you. That's it. That's all it is. And like I said, it works for any niche, any industry. Whatever you, obstacles you've overcome, leverage that. Share that story. Put that link, your custom vanity URL, in any profile you're on, whatever profile you're on. I would use that. I'd put the URL on all, all of them. I have the same URL on all of my profiles. They all go to the same. I shouldn't say the same link. They all go to the same page. I have tracking links behind them, so it's a little more advanced, but you don't need that right now. You just need to set up your one URL post that URL on all your social media platforms, driving it back to that lead capture page. Some people are going to put their name and email in. Some people are going to watch that video. Some people are going to purchase. Again, it's working for you, whether you're working or not. That's the beautiful thing. So get this thing set up. If you have questions, drop them down below. I'll do my absolute best to answer them. Uh, if you're a dad and you want a little more step-by-step -step details, check out my link down below, adamdukes.com forward slash go. And you can check out the video that I have just for you, just for dads to help you start an online business, doing something very, very, very similar to what I just explained in this video. So as always, thank you so much for watching. I truly do appreciate it.